Yes, hi YouTube. I was gonna do an application, show you how to do an application of putting bullet lens on my wood. I'm gonna show you how this is done and uh, I'll talk about my process and how I do it. So let's, uh, I'm gonna put on a coat real fast. I'll show you how this works. Get your fingers in some oil. Rub it in, get it in there good. More oil. Some more. Just showing you how this is done, how you do this correctly, and rub it in with your hands. Then down here, a little bit of oil in there. See how I'm doing that? And then put a little more on there. I don't think it will stick all dirty either, as I just did. Oh well, a little bit better won't hurt. Just wipe it back. Okay, a good rule of thumb when you're putting on oil. Is to uh, wipe it back after 10, 15, 20 minutes, whatever. Whichever choice you want to do, but that's what you're going to do. So, rule of thumb also, these rags here, these oily rags. They can spontaneously combust, so be careful with that. They can very easily catch on fire. I've actually seen videos where they spontaneously combusted in, in flames. It's usually when they wad them up and they have a bunch of them. So, big no-no. Don't do that. It's dangerous, very dangerous to do that, so don't do it. It's not a good thing to do. Now I'm going to try the... Uh, Furniture clinic bullet lens you all here, which I'll show you here. It's this stuff right here. It's very thick. I like this stuff right here. It's a furniture clinic bullet lens seed oil. See that? And I'm gonna use on this stick here using an eye drop tool, okay? So I'm gonna show you how this is done. Let's open her up. Take our eye drop tool. Take our little eye drop tool right here. Prop it in there. Squeeze it. Don't make a mess. And then grab your stick here. And then you just put a little on like that. And rub it in. Give it a good rub in. Like that. Do another bit of oil. You just go down the stick, you just rub it in. Like that. You just keep rubbing it in. Rub it in real good. With your hands get the heat going with your hands. And it doesn't take many drops once you get your stick well oiled. Let's do this, finish this baby off. Drop. I like to take my rubber tip off. Okay, that's done. 
So the process is, uh, what I go through is I, uh, I start off with, uh, let me put this in this camera fast. I don't want to tip it over. I already tipped it over. Tipped over some oil before and it's no fun. This stuff's expensive. So, my process is I go through it and I put on seven coats of that full strength boiled linseed oil. As you can see here, I put on seven coats of that full strength boiled linseed oil. You can use sunny side clean strip, whichever you want to use. And then I go and I, make, I put them on, I soak them on there and let them soak in. And then after about seven times or seven days, I put on the furniture clinic boiled linseed oil. Which you just watched me put on. And it, it really adds a lot of gloss. And it's very thick. I don't know if you can see that. Maybe you can. I don't know. It's very thick. And it's uh, high quality stuff. Um, some people don't like to use bare hands like me. But I like to touch and peel the wood. So that's just my point. If you want to use gloves, go ahead. So the old times used to say back in the day when they used to put oil on there would uh they used to put one coat a day every day for seven days once a week for a month then once a month for a year and then once a year for life and they start looking like this right here they just get nicer and nicer with each coat Now, now, one thing people don't know, they say, oh, is it waterproof? Is it waterproof? That question is no, it's not waterproof, but it is water repellent. If you get caught in a rainstorm, I highly doubt it's going to do anything to your stick. It's going to take several days of rain to actually do damage to your stick. If you get it home and you get a bunch of rainstorm, just grab a rag and wipe it back, which I'm going to do with this one right here. I'm going to wipe back the stick right here real fast. Let's see if I can do it and show you guys it, how I do this. Let's see if I can't get that rag up there. In. I know it sounds goofy, but don't leave it in the sun for too long, these rags, because they'll spontaneously combust, so don't do that. Just make sure you uh, let them hang over something and let them dry. And then when they're fully dry, wet them down with water and throw them away. Some say throw them in a coffee can and then throw them away, but if you don't have a coffee can, well, wet them down and throw them away. Okay, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed me watching me put on coats of oil. Take care. God bless.